This video is brought to you by DICE, the global entertainment content marketplace. In today's episode of Facts for Thought, we'll be discussing Tesco's decision to discontinue their CD and DVD aisles across all stores in the UK, the decline of physical consumption of music and film, and what effects this decision will have on the industry going forward. If you are a content buyer acquiring titles for your channel or platform, or if you are a content seller looking to get your content out to a global audience, please get in touch with us via our website, connect.digital, or email us at dicesales at connectdigital.com. Without further ado, let's explore this breaking news. In February, Tesco officially announced their plans to stop selling CDs and DVDs across all stores in the UK, alongside plans to clear all music and film aisles by the end of the month. When the announcement was made, some stores had already cleared their respective aisles, replacing them with the likes of home furnishings. Despite this change, video games will still be sold in the stores. Tesco's reasoning for this decision has been largely influenced by the dramatic change in how music, film, and television media has been consumed over the past few years. The boom of streaming services such as Spotify, Netflix and Amazon Prime have led to people consuming their media via online subscriptions, leading to the downfall of physical sales such as CDs and DVDs. This past year has seen a decline in the sales of physical products in the UK, with products diving 18.5% to a measly £1 billion in revenues. Digital revenues, however, rose by 8.3% to £8.7 billion, now worth more than the entire market was in 2019, according to the Entertainment Retailers Association. A spokesperson at Tesco said, As more customers move towards digital entertainment, over the last month we have begun to phase out some products in our entertainment range, focusing instead on ranges where we see the highest demand from customers, such as homeware and outdoor products. This movement was first taken by Sainsbury's, who made the exact same move in late 2021, clearing out DVD, Blu-ray and CD shelves over the Christmas period. This decision falls in line with the decline of Blockbuster, Woolworths and more over the past decade. This leaves HMV as the UK's only large-scale entertainment retailer, with more than 100 outlets after being rescued from administration in 2019, which led to the closure of about a fifth of all of its stores. Brian Roberts, a retail analyst at Shopfloor Insights, had this to say. People are consuming entertainment in different ways, such as through streaming. These products are a massive faff in terms of supply chain and replenishing shelves, and they are quite a low profit margin part of the store, so homewares are viewed as a better bet. Whilst this news is huge for many across the UK, how does this affect producers and platforms going forward? It's becoming increasingly clear that selling physical forms of media, such as music, film and television, isn't as good of a source of revenue as it used to be. Digital consumption has become the norm over the past few years, with audiences wanting a constant supply of fresh, high-quality content. Many huge blockbuster companies have switched over to streaming, such as Disney with Disney Plus and HBO with HBO Max. This trend is predicted to continue over the next decade, with physical sales falling further under the radar. Furthermore, the use of digital marketplaces, such as DICE, are a key part of the current movement of the film and TV industry. As an OTT platform, you have the choice of tens of thousands of unique, high-quality titles to expand your platform with, and as the producer, you have the opportunity to reach buyers across the globe, expanding your reach and your revenue. So why not take the next step for your business? What do you think of this news? Do you agree with our findings? As always, you can get in touch with us via our website, connect.digital, or you can email us at dicesales at connectdigital.com for business inquiries. Be sure to subscribe to our channel for more videos like this one. Have a great day.